Hello guys, welcome back to the channel and yes ladies and gentlemen I am going to start another career mode on this channel and uh, of course this will be the first career mode on FIFA 22 um, and uh, I had to make a decision I could either pick uh, the create a club uh, mode thingy um, but let's be honest if any of you guys have played it it's pretty shit this year um, yeah, I don't like the game mode at all. It's not really that that fun. The only fun thing is that you can change the kit every year. But yeah, apart from that, it's really shit. So I decided let's pick a normal team. Uh, and not a team that's really bad, but also not a team that's like really good. Um, and I thought to myself, ah, let's not pick the Premier League again. So I came up with AS Roma, or what well, it's called in FIFA now, Roma FC. They're in the Conference League, the new uh, new feature in FIFA, and I was like, you know, it would be fun to play the Conference League, you know, see all the animations and stuff. And it's in the Serie A, which is a very good league, a very competitive league, just like the Premier League. Of course, it's not as good as the Premier League, but it still isn't easy to become champion in this league, especially on Ultimate Difficulty. So, I thought Ace Roma is a fun squad as well. They're pretty decent young squad you know um, it's not the best but it's still in FIFA they're pretty good um, and as you can see here domestic success is high continental success is high brand exposure is high financial medium youth development medium so it's pretty basic stuff uh, transfer budget of 39.8 million and uh, club worth of 517 million that is a lot the kits as well I don't like the kits yeah, I don't know why, but yeah, it just looks so dumb. The away kit looks more like the Juventus kit, but yeah. Founded in 1927, Roma FC is based in Roma. Really? I didn't know that. <laughs> They've been crowned champions three times and have won the domestic cup on nine occasions, which means they haven't won a European trophy, which hopefully will be the first to get that. Let's click. What do we get now? Of course, this um, home stadium. Yeah. I don't really... I, I'm just going to keep it like this. The stands. Uh, Roma. They're more like a bit of brown reddish kind of color, aren't they? Let's just pick... Let's just pick this one. Duel. Oh, we can pick duel. That's nice. Let's pick the. Ah. Uh, I don't know actually. Rome. Let's just pick red and yellow. I guess. I'm sorry, guys. I'm a. I'm a. I'm a little bit sick. Not really sick. I just have a, a little cold. So if I sniff a bit during the video, I'm sorry. Um. I can't really do much about that. Let's just make it red. I'm just gonna keep it red. Let's not get too into this. It's a fucking stadium. The pitch can stay the same. All fine by me. Here, this is the important stuff. Of course, ultimate four minutes. Uh, yes, Euros. We're in Italy. Uh, negotiation strictness. Never put this on strict um, because you will never be able to buy a player above the rating of 86. Um, I don't know why that is, but for some reason, even if you're at PSG, Man City, players above the rating of 86 will just say they're not willing to go to like a worse league than they're in. Uh, and for some reason, they haven't fixed it. But yeah, that's EA. They're probably not going to fix anything uh, about career mode in this FIFA. Maybe in the next one, but not in this one. So these settings are all fine. So let's uh, load in. And uh, yeah, I think... That, well, this is the first time I've done a, a career mode on YouTube outside of the Premier League. I actually also wanted to maybe do one with uh, Angers in France. But since I've already done a career mode in the French League or the Ligue 1 on Football Manager, I was like, let's just pick Italy this year. This year. You know, just try it out. It might be fun. Um, the Roma side is pretty decent. If I can just like just think of some players like the Pellegrini guy, uh, the 
uh, what's his name uh, the Zaniolo guy he's pretty good all young talents you know they can grow you know help us get further in our league uh, I'll just pick Rome FC I'll just pick Rome FC yeah you see YouTube on yeah, I was I was thinking of doing it but in the end I didn't do it Signore, signori. Yeah, we're, not, we're gonna skip this. I, I don't honestly, I don't care. We'll pick the South America Continental Cup. Yeah, I'm hoping this career is gonna be fun. So I have had fun with the Southampton and uh, uh, yeah, the Southampton career mode. And my, yeah, that was the most fun. All these. Oh wait, yeah, of course the youth player. They've been really good this year with the youth player. Because last year was a bit shit, but this year I think they've nailed it really well. And for some reason we have a bit more money than we should. Oh, I misclicked. But let's have a look at the youth development. So I'm formerly in the academy assigned to each of the following positions. Goalkeeper, defender, midfielder, four. It's actually a pretty tough one. I am going to buy a scout though. I am going to try and put in youth, just like Roma does in real life. Get 25 games with at least one goal scored this season. That's easy. We're definitely going to do that. So I'm three players from South America. Wow. They really like South America, don't they? Win the Conference League. I can understand that. We're a pretty strong team. Coppa Italia reached the quarterfinal and finishing the Champions League play. Damn. They're asking a lot from us. Within two seasons, increase your club worth by 20% through player sales and the competition prize money rewards. Yeah, we can do that. I can't really do much about it, it's just try and play the best football I can, really. But, the most interesting part, as you can see here. Okay, okay. F first look of the team is pretty decent. Oh, I forgot about Mkhitaryan, he's been really good in real life this year. Huh. Let's, let's sign this guy on a two-year contract, yeah. So, our keepers are fine. Patricio, he can stay, and Fusato. This guy, yeah, he can get sold. I don't need him. Then we have Vigna. Okay, 23, he looks good. And Spinazzola, who is really good. Especially in real life, he's like a real workhorse. I wish he was at Chelsea. <laughs> um, yeah, and then they have the Califiori guy. I'm going to loan this Califiori guy out. I think... He might actually, I think he might grow to like a good rating. Then we have Mancini, fine. Even yes, yes, we like this guy. Yeah, 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 good potential. This guy, Fazio, you have to go. You've had a long career, it might be time to end it. <laughs> Chris Smalling, yeah, he can stay. He can be back up. Uh, so we definitely need a centre back. Or we can call Kim Kimbula. Oh no, we have him. Oh wait, so we don't need a centre back, never mind. Um, Okay, so centre back is fine. Uh, this guy, you can go, not good enough. Then we have Rick Karsdorp. I know this guy. Uh, yeah, you can stay. Santon, you can go. I'll just use the right, 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 uh, Reynolds guy as a backup. Then we have this guy, Dabu. Okay, okay, he might be decent. Diawara, I know him. Uh, Very Toots. Ooh, ooh, 28 years old, 82 rated, is he really good in real life? I don't know, I, I don't really watch Italian football. Uh, they have Clive at, uh, on loan at Nice, yeah we don't need him, uh, this guy can go, this guy can go as well. I'm sorry if they're good in real life, I'm just not looking at that, if they're not good in FIFA they can fuck off. This guy can get loaned out, he's under the age of 20 and he's 64 eight. he can get loaned out. For part of 17, yeah, he can get loaned out. It's basically like a youth player. Then our captain. Yeah, well, yeah, he looks like the best player we have. Al Shirari and Mkhitaryan. Yeah, they can be our two wingers. Fine by me. One year, fine. I don't care about the wage. We're probably not going to bite much or anyone. Right wing, fine. Yo, this guy can go. Nah. What? Why is he at Roma? Honestly. This guy, ooh, looks like a talent. And of course, Tammy Abraham. So, um, yeah, the only thing we really need is a, like a backup striker. 
We're back up to Tammy. But the U flame might be a good strike, so I don't know. Um, I'm probably gonna play the 4 2 3 1 formation. I really like that this year. Um, so we're just gonna have to take a look at the youth player and then we'll see what happens. Uh, this double guy, can he get loaned out maybe? Because we have Diawara, Veritut, we have Cristant, and we have Pellegrini. Okay, we might need a backup cam. I think what I'm going to do is loan this guy out. No, no, uh, no, 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 not loan him out. Keep him here. I'll just have these four as the, like the four defensive mids, and then I'm gonna get a backup cam, a younger one, to be back up to uh, uh, what's his face, uh, Pellegrini, and we'll go on from there. I think that would be a good plan. I, I don't also don't want to buy in too many players um, at the start because, of course, it's still early in the season, and yeah. I think this guy might be a cam. Wait, yes, second wind. I've never ever seen that on a youth player, on a youth scout player. He's six foot six. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Six foot six. He's awful though. He's like a, I don't know, like a cam, I guess. He's definitely not getting a strike with 53 finishing. Jesus Christ. Honestly, I think he might be sent him in, but his tackling is awful. Do I want a cam that's six foot six and has 51 strength and 32 aggression? My guy, are you like a teddy bear? Jesus Christ. He has a good short pass, so... Um, yeah, I guess Cam. He's only 16, so that's really young. So I might just loan him out, honestly. I'm not going to have him as a... I, I don't think I want him. I feel really bad for the guy, but he's 6'6". Six six. How tall is that in, like, meters? Is that, like... 2 meters or something like that? That's fucking crazy, man. I did not expect that one, honestly. They have the 4 2 3 1 white. I, I want the narrow one. I want like the two cams. And I guess Mikitarian will start with Zaniola on the right, Pellegrini in the middle, and then Temi at the strike spot, and then Vertu and yeah, Cristante. Pretty basic stuff. Let's get the keeper out. I think I want. Um, but we have Boya Majo Mayoral. Yeah, I don't like Boya Mayoral, really. Let's just get... Uh, Vigna. I really want to play Vigna, but yeah. <laughs> kind of difficult when you have Spinazzola in your team. So, it will mean that for now I will put Mayoral. I think I might just end the loan. I don't want Mayoral, he's terrible. So, we would have... Uh, I need another midfielder on the bench. Give me a midfielder. Yeah, the dog. Wait, we have the Villa guy. He might play as Cam. 59 pay. No, he ain't playing Cam. Okay, that guy needs. The Villa guy needs to leave. I didn't even see that one. Hold up. Um, let's put Darbo on the bench. <laughs> so we'll have Cristiano Devrito in the middle. Spinazzola on the left back. Ibanez and Mancini. Uh, Let's switch these two around because his weak foot is terrible. Then cast up on at right back, Patricia in goal. Then we have Al Sharari, our new striker, which we'll buy. So I'm not gonna play with him or the young guy. No way. Then we have Vigna. Let's organize a little bit. Vigna and Smalling, uh, Perez, Diawara, and Darbu. So that's good. Let's see. What is his stats, this guy? Is he like a big tall strike or like a fast one? Yeah, he's definitely like a young fast player. He can play on the wing as well. Yeah, his stats aren't really that great. He has good finishing though. I'll give him that. But I think I'm just going to learn him out. Sell this Shomorodov Shumar guy from Uzbekistan. 
probably really nice country but yeah you're just fucking terrible uh, so we need a striker and a cam basically well I am going to I'm going to probably end the episode here this was just a quick startup video you know starting the Roma FC career mode um, but yeah I hope it's gonna be fun next episode I will be back with uh, the transfer targets I'll have at striker and a cam I'll probably play the first game against Atalanta or Bergamo Calcio but that's Atalanta basically that's a terrible draw uh, first game of the season Jesus Christ oh, our group is terrible in the conference league we're gonna easily sweep that but yeah against Atalanta um, I'll probably get the two players in uh, the youth scout um, you know we'll see you in the next episode I hope you guys enjoyed like subscribe share the video do all that stuff it really helps trust me um, and I'll see you guys next time when uh, we'll start with the We'll basically really start the career with our first game as well. Peace.